Greetings, programs. This is Wretch. Welcome back to World of Warcraft Battle for Azeroth. And check it out, guys. We are just a little bit northeast of the Shuljai Tar Pits. And remember, we were looking for that one NPC that was eluding us. Well, here he is, and he's actually kind of hard to miss. Ugh, come on. Cut in half by the Sethrak. This is no way to go. Cool. Yeah, that is not a way to go. Chadwick Paxton. What now? I seem to be in a bit of a predicament. My squad was scouting on behalf of Lady Sylvanas when we were ambushed by some snake men calling themselves Sethrak. As you can see, my legs have been separated from my body in the ambush. It's just a flesh wound, luckily. Care to help me get reattached? Then we can get down to this business of vengeance against the Sethrak. Recover Chadwick Paxton's legs. Watch your back. Just be gentle when you get my legs. They tend to wiggle when they get detached. Eh, uh, okay. What is it? Uh, care to give me a hand? Well, specifically my leg. My hands are just fine. Okay, I, uh, I got your legs. What now? Beware. Our enemy is uh, just jab that one part in. There. Not too bad. Have you done this before? I am forsaken. Nah, that feels a lot better, I think. Time to get down to the business of some proper revenge. I do believe it's time to show these Sethrak the meaning of Pain. Reuniting the company? Show of force. Right then. First order of business. Rescue the remnants of my company. These Sethrak kept yelling about expanding their empire and conquering Azeroth as they attacked us. Lovely, really. They killed most of my company and took some hostages. I assume they're being told how grand the Sethrak Empire is. I'd like the remnants of my company back, if you please. I'll be... I'll be... I'll put in a good word over with Lady Sylvanas once this is all over. Not that someone like you needs it. Rescue the remnants of Chadwick Paxton's squad. And... Eh, technically some upgrades to my wrist armor. Show of force. These things called the Sethrak think that we're easily handled. That's only because we were ambushed and not ready for a fight. Well, alright. Perhaps be perhaps we were easily handled, but that doesn't mean we won't strike back. Kill as many of those Sethrak as you can. I don't know who they are or what they want, but I do know one thing. They signed their death warrants when they attacked my squad and cut me in half. Defeat ten Sethrak. Our time will come. I'll move up ahead to higher ground. Let the squad know to rendezvous at my location. Hm. Desert in a swamp. What are the Sethrak up to? Eh, maybe looking to scramble for some sort of holden after what we did to them in Voldoon. Stranger things have happened. Ah, snake people. How I've missed you. Oh, holy crap. That was interesting. Saw right through my sap. Well, that is unfortunate. However, that does give us our first two kills. Bleached Bone Staff of the Quick Blade. What do the staffs look like here? Those look pretty cool. Not for roguey purposes, but still. There's no way that Swindle Gear is actually here attempting to save me. You cannot stop the sands from spreading. I already stopped the sands from spreading. Like, I don't know I don't know if you got the memo. Thanks for the rescue. These Sethrak are looking for some sort of shadow magic in Nazmir. Who knows why? Eh, you know. 
bunch of slithery nasties looking for magic. This is nothing new to us. Sup? I don't believe it. Swindle gear. Over here. Flash of exp or flask of expressed poison. I don't like the fact that these Forsaken can see through my stealth. Boop. Didn't think I'd see a friendly face in this place. Thanks for the save. Did you hear Ingrid's plan yet? I uh, don't think I've ever met Ingrid. I guess she is next up on the rescue docket. Ingrid Bellix. <laughs> I knew we'd be rescued. Well, maybe I just hoped really hard. Over here! Um, I love killing Spree. Ooh, you have a quest for me. What is it? <laughs> Thanks for the rescue. I could use your help in a little plan that I have. The commander of this place is a Sethrak called Sithis. He's got this thing called a Sky Collar Gem. Word is they're looking for some sort of shadow magic in Nazmir to try and really power this thing up. <laughs> Luckily, yours truly has her own shadow magic to do just that. Maybe you do too. I don't keep up on what powers you keep getting. Get the gem from Silthus and we'll have some real fun afterwards. Recover the Sky Collar Gem from Fang Collar Silthus. Embrace the shadow. I'll get out of here while you take care of things. Then we'll see what this gem can do. Okay, well, we got one more rescue to do here. Dun, 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 dun. You, Swindle Gear, I've heard all about you. Get me out. Oh, that's a woman. Never mind. <laughs> Whoopsie. We'll do a better voice later. I gotta look at them first to see. Will follow you. For the appropriate voice. Boop. This cannot be. No, I can assure you it, it can be. Not what a relief. The Sethrak want some sort of magic to unlock the power of one of their artifacts. So she's going to talk like uh, Jane from Team Rocket? Okay. I can do that. And we got two Sethrak right here, and then we'll go pay a visit to uh, the Skycaller. How you doing? Sap. Silva? Sap. Silva. Your lands are next to fall. Uh -huh. Boop. And there we go. Dun 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 dun. Oh, look at him. He's training. Sap. Ooh, actually. Take your silver. Do some mining. Get some more storm silver. And... You will not stop us from finding the Sky Collar Gem's true power. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you guys are old news, I'm afraid. And the only one who don't know is you. Fool, the others will come back. Lightning crackles from within the depths of this gem. Max of 25 can be collected. <laughs> Collect the whole set. And I guess this was the high ground they were talking about. 
Come on, Chadwick. We can fry them with a Sky Collar gem that Swindle Gear is going to get. We'll put it to a vote. All those in favor of staying in a dangerous swamp to watch someone else kill snake people. Yeah, oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And all those against? Nay, nay. The yeas have it. Looks like we're staying to watch a lightning show. Speak quickly. Fine work. It's good to be reunited, both with my body and my squad. Good, I can hear their screams from here. They will remember the Horde. Do you have Ingrid's gem? Please tell me you do. She's been absolutely insufferable about it. Excellent work, Freed Ingrid. She's told me about this particular gem, and the company has voted that you should test it out on our snake enemies. The Sethrax seem to believe there's something in Nazmir that can unlock the destructive power of this gem. We don't have that, but we have the next best thing. An insane warlock who is willing to experiment with magic. Speak with Ingrid and have her begin the process to unlock the true power of this gem. Have Ingrid empower the Skycaller gem. Embrace the shadow. I am forsaken. Don't experiment with shadow magic, they told me. It'll do all of Azeroth if you keep delving into this, they warned me. Give me back my arm. You can't use it as a component, he screamed as I pulled his arm off. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm just reminiscing. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I need you to empower the Skycaller gem. Trust no one. Ooh, I've been waiting to do this for a while. Stand back. All this power. <laughs> Excellent work, Ingrid. Not disconcerting at all. What would you ask of death? That gem appears to be ready to do some damage. Let's just point it elsewhere for now. Farewell. Uh, boss. Swindle gear, I think we have a new snake problem. Ooh. Oh. Okay, so that's like the Technodrome drills. Interesting. So they use those spires to travel. This has been quite the educational day. This had better be good. It appears the Sethrak are quite serious about keeping this gem. I do wonder where they found it in the first place. Hmm. Perhaps Lady Sylvanas would be interested in this as well. Something to ponder. Ingrid believes this gem can unleash lightning and shadow magic of her, of her words, not mine, epic proportions. I do believe it would be best for everyone if you tested it out on the small Sethrak army currently looking for us. Defeat 20 enraged Sethrak with the Skycaller gem. Remember, patience. Have fun with the gem. I think the ritual kept it mostly intact. Boss, how did you survive? I saw you get cut in half. Ugh, Clayton, we're undead. Of course we can survive getting cut in half. Sometimes. It's not the first time I've been cut in half. Hopefully it'll be the last, though. When was the first time you were cut in half? That information is classified. <laughs> okay, well, we'll leave the Forsaken to their forsaken -y things. Use the Seth Skycaller gem to evaporate any Sethrak in the area. Will only work near the spire. <laughs> power! Unlimited power! <laughs> oh, that's satisfying. More. Ooh. The Skycaller. The Skycaller gem is overloading. Who knows what'll happen if you use it now? For science! Judgment Bolt? Eh. Oh! It's looking like the end of Infinity War over here. <laughs> Swindle gear? I don't feel so good. 
All right, that's good. We need one of those. I am going to put it on the docket. Let's see, there's there's Bucky and Wanda and Black Panther. Too soon. Oh, and, and Groot. Let's not forget Groot over there. <laughs> that was amazing. And you're still alive. That's a relief, but I believe it was a tad over the top for my tastes. Does it seem like overkill to anyone else that we annihilated several scores of Sathrak over killing a few of us? No? Right. Just me, then. Speak quickly. Good work. The Sethrak will be back, but we've proven our point, which is don't cross the horde. With that business over with, my squad will be off. Hopefully the next time we will meet under nicer circumstances. Beware the living. All right, move out. We don't have more of this place to, we have more of this place to scout and we can't get ourselves ambushed again. I don't think that's our fault, boss, given that we were, t were attacked by a group that wasn't supposed to be here. Uh, we should have seen the attack coming. We were supposed to be on the lookout. It was Tucker. The Sethrak killed him first. Tucker. Should have known. At least the, he paid the price for his incompetence. Uh, keep it down. Lady Sylvanas won't be happy if we... fail our mission. Is she ever happy, boss? She will be if we do our jobs properly, Ingrid. I like this motley undead crew. Okay, well, happy trails and all that. Okay, now that we're done with that... We killed Snake Men. Oh, we should have gone over to the Construct, shouldn't we have? Oh, I don't think this, that was considered part of the Spire, though. Was it? Nope. Okay, so it, would, it wouldn't have worked here. Would have been amazing if so. Well, here's what we're going to do. Let your death be a lesson to the others. We're going to try and kill the ads and everything as quick as we can. Because, quite frankly, I want to see if we can take this thing down. Where's our new... Okay. Here's our new wrist armor. I need actually need to make sure that we need to start selling some stuff. We're running out of bag space. You've been blinded, you've been sapped, and you... The sands will swallow you! Okay. We should be okay, maybe? Will be right around here. Ooh! Oh, s oh no. Oh, they're right. To get these guys taken care of. Okay, we'll repost and cloak of shadows. This cannot be. Take out this binky. Okay, now it's just us. I've gotten out of worse fights, worse jams. You keep you to keep your doom gaze to yourself there. Oh. And I don't know if that's considered a uh, an AoE. Oh no. He woke up from the blind. Boop. Oh, that was so close. Okay, we do have some people dead though. Let's eat some sun fruit. And we do have Killing Spree up and running. Okay, so Sap. And... Shank. Sky Crawler. Okay. 
We are in a much better situation than we were previously. We just need to keep our eye on our sapped friend. That's going to take a while though, so... Oh, get out of the stupid. We're getting close to having a lot of our stuff um, off, off, off a cooldown. Which is preferable. Oh, okay, he's back. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Alright, I think we got this. Unless there are respawns. And shank! And down you go. See, I love fights like that, where I actually have to use a little bit of strategy, as they say. Good, good, good. Alrighty. Now, let's head back and tell Witch Doctor Kajabu everything that we had done over here on this side. Because <laughs> we got a, got a lot done. And then we, I guess we'll go have a chat with the Baron. Blood Fever Tarantula. A Tarantula! Ugh, I don't like spiders that much, so... Not really high on my list of priorities. Now, what were we letting him know? Where? Look at this. You came back alive. Flight out of Harik's lair. Oh, yes. About the snake. Or not the snake. The uh, bat loa. No worries, my friend. There you are. I was beginning to get worried. What happened? Yeah, Joe Chung is alive. The loa Harik, though. You did what? But it is not permitted to. You are not to be killing Loa. Too late. You need the voodoo. Sorry. You did what you had to do. I can't believe this Cahoon could corrupt the Loa of all things. Nazmier is a cursed place for everybody. Take it easy. Undercover sister. <laughs> Okay, well, looks like our business here is finally concluded, except for having a chat with the Baron. Oh, neat. We've earned at least friendly reputation with all the factions. Ooh. Okay, well, should we go ahead and... I actually think that it would be better to go ahead and, and get that out of the way, because what that's probably going to do is give us that hearthstone and unlock some world quest for us. If we wish to go... Ah, no. Story. Let's just deal with the story. We got plenty of time. We haven't even touched Darkshore yet. Dungeons, raids. We got plenty of content along, along the road, guys. Now I don't have to worry about grabbing a spectral raven. Uh, I'm in the summoning circle. Court of Spirits. Oh yeah, there's there's some nonsense we got to deal with here in this area, isn't there? Zombies and such. I would assume. I think we've seen them. Yeah, sorry, it's been a while. <laughs> Hanzabu? I bet that knee's starting to hurt. 
And Zalazane's still up there having a having some fun. Hello, hello. <laughs> You're going to make a deal, eh? You'll be brave to come here, but you need to have more than just bravery if you'll be wanting Bomb Sunday's favor. What you be asking old Bomb Sunday? Remnants of the damned. Ever since the spirits have been calling upon this Gehun, me temple has been covered with the unbearable taint of the undead. The undead be an abomination, but the bloodstones that create them be powerful. They could be of use to bomb someday. If you wish to show me your fervor, then cleanse me temple of their filth and bring me their bloodstones. Collect six decaying bloodstones for bomb someday. A desecrated temple. The spirits of the faithful flock to me temple. You see them out there, yes? They come to enter the other side and join me realm. However, spirits who've been turned their backs upon Bomb someday, they too have to come to me temple grounds. They praise one called Gahoon and spread their blood magic desecration across the necropolis. This ends now. Go out there and remove the desecrations that be infesting me temple. Destroy five vile desecration within the necropolis. And that which haunts the dead. Bomb someday knows why you be here. You be seeking me favor. Bomb someday ponders you silently. A test to see if you be worth Bomb someday's time. There be spirits who spray us sing something called Gahoon. They pay me homage no more. I will not allow the desecration of me own temple. Go and subdue the strongest of the ancient spirits. If you do this for me, you may be worth the trouble after all. Defeat Hex Priestess Tzeja er, and Warlord Malaja. 286. Ooh, and a new belt. Shoot! Run along, man. Why someday be watching you? I need to get back to Zobal. There are still more souls to gather before I can pay off my debt. And I bet you got a well, I will see you soon. And I bet you gotta stretch your legs since you've been on your knees for quite a while. Alrighty. Well, let's see what we got here. We've got reanimated horrors. Hey, how you doing? How you doing? Gather round, gather round. Decaying Bloodstone 1. Alright. Vile Desecrations? What do the Vile Desecrations look like? Guess we're gonna find out. Conjured Spirit? Ah! Yeah, these... Oh. These don't look good. We'll just go ahead and shoot them. Cahoon balls. And can't sap. Eh, don't matter. Still got him. Shrink. Hmm, ghastly goose. Or ghastly ooze. Well. Let's see. These guys, these corrupted spirits aren't really giving me anything new. I love the fact that you can cheap shot a, a ghost. That <laughs> just, that's always tickled me. Off you go then. <clears throat> oh, all these voices, my, th my voice is finally starting to give out. 
And there you go. Alright guys, well I think that is a good amount of work for one day. I think we'll end it here and in the next episode we'll take out the Warlord Malaja and the Hex Priestess as well as getting the rest of our decaying bloodstones taken care of and uh, we'll keep on going down this netherworldly rabbit hole that Bomb Samde has for us because yeah, when you make deals with anything of a supernatural nature, you have to be very careful. It doesn't matter if it's fae, or angels, or demons, or uh, undead troll loa. <laughs> but, hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you liked the episode, please leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, that'd be a big help. And we'll see you next time. Later days, everyone. <laughs>